friends from the media. Um, we are here for and on behalf of the leadership of the National Democratic Congress. And we are here in the wake of the mindless killing of three innocent citizens of Idra. We are here not because one or two of the people who have been murdered are members of the NDC. And we are here primarily because all the people who have been murdered and injured are citizens of Ghana. And this is not an attack on any political party or any town, but an attack on all of us as Kenyans. We are here to console the families of those who have lost their loved ones and the injured. To check up on them, see how they are doing, encourage the doctors to do their best, to stabilize them, and hopefully help their speedy recovery. Now let me state that as a political party, we are completely appalled and disgusted at what happened in the draft a few days ago. The state-sponsored killing of innocent young men of this town by the military is not only reprehensible and condemnable, but it is barbaric, it is evil, and it is an issue that has eroded, totally eroded, the confidence that many citizens have in our security agencies. We condemn it in no uncertain terms, and we are here demanding for justice. Justice to appease the souls of those who have been murdered and their families. Justice to appease the souls and the families of those who have been injured. And we are demanding that first and foremost, those who murdered Ibrahim Mohammed, a.k.a. Kaka, are immediately put before a court of competent jurisdiction, prosecuted, convicted, and punished in accordance with law. We have gathered evidence on the ground, and I'm sure some of you are already aware of that, that the two people who murdered him are known bodyguards of the certain municipal chief executive. And that is a matter of public record in Nigeria. Everybody knows that. The evidence points to that direction. We are aware of attempts by some elements in the police in the area to change the narrative, cover up, and blame the murder on an innocent brother of Ibrahim Mohamed Eki Kaka. And we are telling the police that the people of Edra are following this matter keenly. We are following the matter keenly. We know the eyewitness accounts. We know other relevant testimonies, you know, other witnesses who have information on what transpired. And so no attempt to sweep what has happened under the carpet, to shield the real perpetrators and blame this dastardly act on innocent people who wash. The real culprits, some of whom have been arrested, must be immediately prosecuted, convicted, and punished. But more importantly, we are demanding for the immediate dismissal of the municipal chief executive of Ekira. He is the main brain behind these criminal, barbaric, and evil actions that have gone on or that have taken place in Edra in the past few days. It was his boys who murdered Kaka. Kaka is a known LPP member.